joined by Coach Burroughs for the next game primer leading up to Sunday's game against Mount St. Mary's. Well, Coach, a week off. Describe how the practice schedule is maybe a little bit different and what types of things you worked on. I think this week has been a, a different week because of exams. You know, so like the kids, their schedule is kind of not the norm, so to speak, because, uh, you know, we practice at 12 o'clock one day, 2 o'clock another day, today we're at noon, you know, so your timing is a little off, just trying to, you know, get through practice and, and uh, you're kind of out of that normal routine that you normally have uh, when you have a normal week of practice. The coaching staff always talks about getting better each day at practice. What did you do to get better after the Duquesne game? I think this, this, this week's about skill level. You know, it's almost like uh, having camp, you know, working on ball handling and passing and just the basic fundamentals of basketball, I think, is a way to improve. You know, when you have kids with exams, some kids have two or three, you know, exams in a day, you can't overload those guys with too much information, you know. So it's more about getting a good workout, working on your skill level, you know, your basic ball handling, basic shell defense, just the basics of uh, – our basketball philosophies. Is that nice, the way things have kind of structured in the schedule, to have that opportunity to do this in the middle of the season? I know it, 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 it benefits you, you know, if you, if you use it properly. You know, this time is always a tough time in college basketball, you know, because the kids mentally, you know, you're trying to keep them focused on, on basketball, but, you know, they have academics, you know, you're getting close to the holidays, you know, guys are kind of at that point where they're ready to go home, you know, so from a coaching standpoint, it's always tough to, you know, just kind of keep those guys motivated and keep them focused on, you know, little tasks. And, and the way we structured practice was more about, you know, us getting better on our fundamentals as opposed to, you know, our big game plan on how we're going to beat, you know, Mount St. Mary's. Two more games left before heading to Michigan to start the Big Ten season, Mount St. Mary's Sunday. Describe what types of things you want to see in areas of improvement before you head to Michigan. I think for us it's about us coming out playing hard. You know, uh, this is always, and coaches talk about this, Coach Chambers, you know, this time of year, his theory is this is when you find a lot of upsets in college basketball because everyone's at that stage where, hey, you know, Christmas is around the corner and, you know, most guys are leaving, you know, that game or two games to go home. So their minds are other places. And so it's our job to bring them back, to focus on the task at, you know, beating Mount St. Mary's, a team that's, you know, uh, playing some close games. You know, they play some, you know, Big Ten teams. Um, and they're playing better basketball by looking at the scores of the games they've had so far. They've got four players, five players actually, average around eight points or better, and only one senior on the roster. What have you seen from them on film? You no, know, I think they're a young team. You know, I think they're uh, they're actually playing with a lot of confidence. You know, which sometimes you don't find young teams playing with. Uh, you know, they're they're a scary team too because they have the ability to score the basketball. They have a couple of good guards. You know, so when you have a team that's kind of young and they're not afraid to make mistakes. You know, hopefully you don't come out there very tentative on our end and not play aggressive and play hard. But uh, I think it's going to be an interesting game because of, uh, you know, their style. They do a little Princeton stuff, but not a lot. But I think their confidence in the way they're playing, you know, is always dangerous. A couple things you want to see out of the team on Sunday. I think us is competing. You know, I think we got to come out and compete and play hard. You know, I think we're the bigger team. We're the more physical team. So I would love for us to come out and impose our will you know, on Mount St. Mary's and, and uh, just compete for 40 minutes would be tremendous for us. Best of luck. Thank you.